di sama Jakarta berarti jauh lebih murah. When Abdul first told me about exploring Candi Muara Takus, an ancient temple in Riau of Sumatra, I didn't take it seriously until I saw this. Hello, welcome to Candi Muara Takus. This is one of the Chandi, the temple, which is many, many centuries ago. Actually, with your story, you already own your voice. And with your voice, you will have a deeper connection with the world around us. And the world is waiting for you to be discovered. Until today, the archaeologists are not sure of the existence of this temple. However, they believe that this place has already existed as early as the 4th century. And it was the ruler's administration center during the Sri Vijaya Empire. So basically, this place is a ritual for the royal family long, long time ago. The government started to conserve this place in 1970s. Chandi Muara Takus is the oldest temple in Sumatra and is the only kind that is remaining in Riau. So it seems that the structure always almost similar with Chandi Asoka in India. As you can see here, the structure looks like a cylinder shape and the lower part of the cylinder has the shape of a lotus flower. So it represents Hinduism. It's a place for prayers. So the structure of all the four space, it is square shape. This area has four distinct structure and no one seems to know how long does this Chandi exists. Some say it's during the 4th century, some say it's 7th century, some even say it's 9th century and some even say it's 11th century. So this Chandi, this temple has been built during the Sri Vijaya Empire. So we have the Chandi Tua, Chandi Bongsu, Maligai Temple and this is the Maligai Palangka. Kita ada pre-wedding. Hello guys. Hah, dari Jakarta. Halo. Hai. Ya, pengantin baru, guys. Halo, guys. Ya, subscribe. 13 kota gambar. Oke. Namanya Mas Aidil. Adil. Nora. Nora. Welcome Adil sama Nora. Selamat. So that's the river going across the plantation. Hanford Land is just 10 minutes drive from the Chandi Muara Takus. It's a quick getaway for the locals as it provides a peaceful location for mental healing. It sits in the middle of an oil palm plantation. Soto Padang uses fried pieces of beef in the broth. At the top of Puncak Kompe, you could actually see small islands resembles Raja Empat in West Papua, a great spot for sunset. We are in Kampa district, the view is fantastic. In front of me, there's this beautiful lake. Tempat ini Raja Empat Kampar. Kita lihat banyak pulau-pulau di sini. Viewnya mantap. We are trying the satay here. Satay ayam kuok is one of the 41 types of satay in Indonesia. Juicy slices of marinated meat on a thin bamboo skewers, grilled to perfection on a charcoal open fire. The thick, spicy green sauce that makes it unique. Ini satay kuok, satay asli kuok. Nah, bedanya dengan sate padang dan sate-sate lain itu warna satenya itu warna hijau karena 
bumbunya berbeda. Kenapa sambal itu bisa jadi hijau? Karena di sini dia menggunakan cabai yang berbeda. Kalau ada cabai padang menggunakan cabai merah. Kalau ini dia menggunakan cabai hijau. Jadi ini cabai hijau. Jadi kelihatannya hijau. Kalau yang yang lain biasanya pakai cabainya cabai merah. Jadi kelihatan merah. Ini kan hijau. Dia using the green chili. So the case looks green. Ketupat is a rice cake pack inside a diamond shaped container of woven palm leaf pouch. It's the rice ketupat. And that's it from this video. If you like what you see here, check out one of our other videos. A good place to start would be the popular videos on demand playlist. I love Pekan Baru.